So show me what we're making today. Oh my gosh, we're making quite a few things. We're gonna start with mm. crepes. Mm, crepes. Are you kind of like a sweet or a savory breakfast? Girl? I'm everything. Okay, great. I want it all. Same, same. Well, we're going sweet today. <laughs> we're going sweet today. You can make crepes savory, but today we're going sweet. Okay. Um, so crepes seem really fancy. They seem like something you can't make at home, but you totally can. Okay. Okay, so like here, I want you to, basically I want you to take this flour, dump it in, just pour it in. See, I'm making y'all a meal. In. Salt. This is your next meal, yes. okay? Salt. Yes. Let salt me pay and sugar. That's All okay. of the salt and yeah, sugar? Yeah, get it in, get it in, get it you in. You better teach me, Sophia. I love okay. it. And then as you're, as you're doing that, the sugar, can you, do you think you can whisk and pour at the same time? Ooh, let, let me, me try. See, let's see, let's see. Oh, y'all wish me luck. You see that? Love it. Now keep whisking. Keep, keep whisking. whisking. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop, don't okay. stop, don't stop, don't oh, stop. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep, keep going. going. Oh, That's I got to get more aggressive. That's it. That's it. Okay. So I'm going to pour the milk, and you don't want to pour all the milk because you want to get the clumps out first. So you just want to... Okay. How did you learn to cook? I mean, I've been cooking for 14 years. 14 years. Yeah, it's like something I... I knew I always wanted to be a chef. So I like to say it's the only thing I know for sure that I can do. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay. okay. Keep going, keep going, keep going. And you want this batter to almost look like liquidy. You, I mean, you, you want it to look like you made a mistake. So that's how I know it's ready when it's yes. liquidy. Yes. Thin, thin. Thin. And you can like get, like, you can get, you can show get me. You oh, oh, you, oh, I wasn't doing anything. You can get in here. Get in here, get in oh, here. Oh, she a real cook. Maybe <laughs> I should stand over here, huh? Oh my God. So you get it really nice and thin, and you, it's almost kind of good to work with more flour, or more liquid, excuse me, than you think that you she need. She said, Jennifer, you aren't doing enough. Get out the way. I just was That's like, how they do me at home. They put me out the no, kitchen. No, everybody can cook. Everybody can cook. You think you can't cook? Oh, well, you know, um, come on. Come on. Hey, listen. Come on. So you're gonna take She's this. So, good at it. so you take this oh God, and you're gonna kind of pour it here and you're gonna move this around, right? All the way, 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 all the way. Right? It smells so good. So I so you can do this. We could have gone probably a little thinner, but it's fine, you know? So does it matter how thick or thin it is? No, because see, because you see how we can just do this, you know? And what's gonna happen is your your crepe is gonna get like what we call a frond on the outside of it. And I'm just gonna leave this here and show you. Okay. Yeah, so when you lift this up. You see that edge, how it almost looks like it's got like a frond, like it's almost like a little flaky, right? Yes. So that is what we want, okay? And so we're gonna fill our crepes with a beautiful mm. cream cheese, citrus cream. That sounds so good. How do you feel about cream cheese? Are you like I cream like cream cheese? cheese. Oh. Y'all like cream cheese? Good, okay. Good, and so what we're gonna do is we're gonna fold once and then fold again. So now we see, look it. Look at what we made. That looks pretty too. <laughs> and it probably, I know it's gonna taste good. Yes. Okay. So we're gonna just, can you grab those forks for me? Yes, yes. Give me a job. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Okay. I got okay. the forks if I ain't got nothing else. Okay, so you wanna know a really funny story? Yes. I actually met you at the Met Gala. Uh huh. <laughs> and you don't remember this, but I was there and you came up to me. Look was, at us. It was, yes, it was That's this us. red dress. Yes. And you came up to me and you said, Girl, that was the right option, because <laughs> you look so comfortable. Yes. Okay, so now we're making a recipe that people love. Mm -hmm. It's a whole roasted cauliflower, and even if you feel weird about cauliflower, I just, I'm on, I'm on the quest to change your mind. Okay. It's a very affordable ingredient, okay? And this is great, you don't even have to cut it. Oh. It's awesome, right? So what helps us here are all these spices, or even more than this, right? We have some miso here, which is my favorite ingredient. I actually have the word miso tattooed on my body. Really? I do. That's cool. <laughs> It's my favorite ingredient. I love You're it. I, have, I know I have many tattoos, but that's my favorite one. So we have garlic powder, onion powder, lots of fresh herbs. And then what we end up with is this delicious, like, marinade sauce, yummy situation. Okay. So here's your oh, brush. Got a here's your bowl. Oh. So, like, you're going to be tempted to pour it. Don't brush it. Okay, and why, why aren't we pouring it? Well, what? because we want to get into every, we want to get in all the crevices. Even like in the pack with the leaves, yes, love it. And then this goes in the oven. Like it kind of just cooks itself. It goes itself. in the oven? Now, what, tell me, what's your inspiration behind cooking? Because you're so passionate about it. I am. So I grew up really food insecure. Uh -huh. Yeah, I grew up, um, both my parents were substance abusers. So I grew up really knowing what it felt like to be hungry. And so uh, I'm, now I'm not hungry. Now I just make food all day. It's really mm -hmm. wonderful. So I'm deeply, deeply inspired by my upbringing. Very nice. much so. <laughs> you do a beautiful thing coming. <laughs> and let's just say if you're not a cauliflower fan, you mm -hmm. can do this with broccoli. You can do this with a head of cabbage. You can do it with all kinds of things. It's really great kind of like plant-based dinner that's just not in your face that is plant-based, you know? I ain't laughing. <laughs> okay. Okay, so let's save some of this. Okay. Because we want to brush it. Can I put that in there? Yeah, you can put that okay. in there. Yep, this. And so, like, let's just pretend that this is in the oven. Da -da 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 -da, it's cooked. And now look at what we have. Isn't it stunning? Mm. Great. 
so that we can, looks good. So we can cut into it, and like, isn't it kind of like beautiful the way that you can cut into it, almost like a piece of cake? It do, it looked like a piece of like a, a roast or something. It's so right? amazing, right? It so looks let's so good. Do, let's do this. I'm gonna cut your piece. Oop, oop, sorry. Yeah. They, somebody's I'm laughing over there. Yeah, they love it. I love it. Okay, That's so wait. They won't song. So wait, hold on. Let's. We can now. We can do a little more on there. Get you some sauce. I want to try this. Same. I'm gonna steal this little fork. Oh, good. Okay. Oh, Lots good. of flavor crystals. I told you. I know. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go like that. And you just make this at home, huh? Oh man, it's so easy and so fast. Everything seems super fast. You know what's? But wild? it's super good. All very affordable too. Okay. These are just things that I want people to know more about. Y'all yeah. hear that? She wants us to know more about it. Thank you so much, Sophia, for being here. If you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the Jennifer Hudson Show YouTube channel. Check your local listings or visit JenniferHudsonShow.com to see when you can watch four episodes in your area. And don't forget to sign up for the newsletter.